Hey, my fellow Fall Local Frontiersmen, it's DJ from Carrots and Brotherhood. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be introducing five alternative products that you can use to keep your topic hair fibers locked in so you can go about your day worry free. Stay tuned. If it's your first time here, welcome. Carrots and Brotherhood is all about building confidence in your hair loss through positivity, empathy, and transparency. If you find today's content helpful, make sure you click that subscribe button and also click the little bell for notifications. That way you can be one of the first to know every time I upload new content. So the first two products I'm gonna introduce are actually by the same company, they're from the same company. Both of these are pomade products. Uh, I remember using these back in the day, dude, like way back in the day when I was in like high school, which was, I graduated in 2002, so you guys do the math. But <laughs> they're both petroleum-based products. What they are is just, let's like say, really like a thick pomade, and both of these products are, are pretty good at keeping the fibers in. Uh, there is a difference though, this one here is maximum hold. It almost acts like a wax. And it is really, it's really thick. Um, actually, if I put some on my fingers right now, it's, it's a really, really thick and sticky pomade. The problem with this one though is, uh, it's good for the first few hours, but after that it just gets hard. It gets hard in your hair, and your hair is just like, 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 like hair gel. It becomes hard, and so it begins to look a bit unnatural. Uh, this is probably the one I'd recommend the least. And then this other one here, the second product, the Sport Wave, it's uh, more of a softer, there's a softer jelly type of consistency. This one works really well when you're trying to get the fibers to really stay in a place all day long, but that's the problem. It only lasts about a day, and so your hair will begin to actually dry out. What that means is that your hair starts to lose that shine, uh, like your normal hair shine. It just looks dull. Then this is a great product, guys. It's a really great product, and it's available super fucking cheap. Like, I think both of these products are less than five dollars. Buy them at Walgreens, you can buy them at Walmart, they're on Amazon. Again, if you're in a country that doesn't ship, stay tuned. I got a product that everybody can use, and everybody can find anywhere. The third product I want to show you is actually one that my wife uses in her hair. But it's this product here. It's an argan oil. It's an argan oil, which means that it's a liquid. As you see, it's a liquid. And I was a little bit skeptical, skeptical about the liquids uh, before I tried it. And it works pretty good, actually. It works really good. Put it in, put it in the hair, and then I blow dry it, and then it held the fibers better than I expected. The only downside to this one is that it dries out really quickly. Um, so I think my hair looked dry maybe three or four hours after I applied the fiber. And by dry, I mean like there was no shine. Like it was just black. I went to the store the other day and I was just, you know, browsing the hair product aisle and I found this one. It's also an argan oil. But yeah, this argan oil, I got it because it also has black castor oil in it. Yeah, but I, I, actually, I really like this product. I've been using it for, I think, maybe four days now. I've been using this. I haven't used the pomade. Actually, I don't have the pomade in right now. I have this in right now. So many of you have been saying that you can't find the pomade. And so I've been thinking, like, well, if they can't find the pomade, obviously it's not helpful. So what else can I find? Guys, like these two, these two oils here, these two liquid oils, I'm sure you can find these anywhere. Just go to the women's health sector. Go, <laughs> don't get, don't, you're in the wrong section if you're there. Go to the uh, like women hair products aisle and you'll find one of these products in there or something similar, argan oil or like black castor oil. But I really like this one because like the smell. Yeah, if you surf then you use like board wax. And some of the board wax has this like coconut, pina colada smell to it. It's really beachy, really like summery smell. Uh, and that's what this is, it smells just like that. And I was like, man, as soon as I smelled that I had to have it because the black castor oil pomade that I use, the smell is not bad, it's just, and it's, it's okay, it's an okay smell, but this, man, this smells great. It smells amazing and it works really well. Don't worry, if you can't find any of those products, this next one is available everywhere, okay? So the fifth product, I can spit all over the camera, dude. <laughs> so the fifth product that you can use uh, to keep the fibers in place is something that anybody can find. All right, you probably have it in your house right now, so you don't even have to spend any extra money. All right, so what I want you to do is go to your kitchen, open up the pantry or the cabinet, and what I want you to do is find a bottle of olive oil. <laughs> no joke, guys. Get you a bottle of olive oil. Now, olive oil is a great oil for nourishing the scalp, and it's also a really great oil for preventing breakage. So if your hair is the type of hair that breaks easily, olive oil is really good at adding, like adding health and nutrients to the hair. Um, and because it's an oil, I'm like, well shit, let me try it for the hair fibers. So I did. Uh, I put the olive oil in the hair. I you know, put the, put the fibers in and it worked. Surprisingly, it worked really well. And because it's oilier, 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 more oily, 
<laughs> if it's, it's more oily than the other products, like it lasts longer, which means I was, I can imagine wearing this in my hair for like two days or maybe even three days without any problems and the hair fibers will still be there. Now there is a downside to using the olive oil, all right? It's a last resort type of thing because it smells like olive oil, okay? <laughs> like, you remember from the video I teach you how to use topic hair fibers, you know, you put the pomade in and then you put the wave cap on and you blow dry it. But the problem with that is if you blow dry it with heat on the olive oil, you, it smells like somebody's cooking an omelet. <laughs> it smells like oil. Okay, so it's not a terrible smell. You just smell like olive oil. If you know what that smells like, it just smells like olive oil. If you have any questions, drop in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Again, my name is DJ from Keratin Brotherhood. I'll see you guys in the next video.